interior and we've put in some, uh, some plating um, for the roll cage and, and different bits and pieces. And we're just going to give you a bit of a walk around the car now and, and sort of uh, step you through uh, the build process. Here we have the um, the front, uh, the, the engine bay in the front of the car. As you can see, there's not much, not much attached at the moment. She's, she's pretty bare. Um, so there's a fuel system there and a steering rack and and some power steering pipes and things. But what you can see we've done here is we've we've plated the top of the, um, the strut tower uh, completely over. And um, around the back, I'm not sure if you can actually see it there, but you see another plate that's on the back of the uh, the strut tower. That's where the uh, the tubes are going to come through the firewall and uh, be attached to the, the strut tower. That should, that should spread the load out a bit. Over this one, this one's only partly done. I've only welded it around just before lunch there. I took a bit of a break. And as you can see, we, we've seam welded um, a fair proportion of the, the seams in the front of the car as well in a, in a bid to, to stop any uh, seams opening up when we actually start pounding through the forests. Now this is the front mounting uh, point for the roll cage. Um, up sort of in the in the front of the, the front door sort of area where the where the front leg comes down and the, down the uh, wind so the windscreen and attaches to that. That plate obviously has to be trimmed. It's a bit wider. You can see it's sticking over the edge there, but you can get the idea of what it's going to look like. And also obviously there's with one over the other side there. As you can see, there's not much in the car at the moment. She's, she's pretty bare. Um, the main hoops are just tacked in position at the moment. Um, just up the side, which is which is good. And you can see the the mountings down here. Um, just sort of tacked in position because we have to drop the cage down yet so we can weld those tricky parts up around the corners. And I'll just move around the back now and show you the uh, yeah. the rear strut towers have, have been plated as well and that's where the, the back stays for the main hoop will, will attach. And that one hasn't they haven't been cleaned up yet. They'll be cleaned up with a grinder and a wire wheel and tied up. As you can it's a bit cavernous in there at the moment. And we're going to do a lot of bar work across the front but I'll, I'll, I'll make this a bit of a... Um, this is the first video and there will be several in this series just showing you how I get on with it and what we get up to.